let's see how we can write to Python files, upload Python files, and run Python files from Jupyter Notebook itself. So first, let me write a sample code here. So if I run this, as you can see, 7 is printed. But let's say you want to write this to a Python file. How can you do it? Now, on top of this, you just need to write percentage percentage write file and a file name let's call it test.py now hit control enter and as you can see it will show writing to text file now it is showing overwriting in my case because i already had a test.py so in your case it will just say writing test.py now this code is returned to test.py so where is this test.py you just type ls it will show you everything that is here so there's also test.py but where is this so as you can see here the directory is c slash user slash visual if you write pwd and hit ctrl enter it will just give you the path now you can copy this path and let's go there hit enter you need to remove this slash first hit enter and here as you can see test.py is created now, if we check this the contents will be what we had in our code so this is the code yeah now let's see how we can load another file into our Jupyter notebook so i'll just hit or enter here so that we are new here let's say we have a file somewhere else let's say we have a python code let me just copy this and let me just rename this file2.py so let's say we have a file somewhere else now we just need to move this to our Jupyter Notebooks directory that is this directory that we just checked. So we just copy this from here, move it here. So this is file2.py, right? And we just copied it into this directory. Now to load this, you just need to write percentage load and then test, sorry, file2.py and hit control enter. And now the code of file2.py will be loaded into your Jupyter Notebook. Now let's say you want to directly run the file and not load the file. So to do that, you just need to write percentage run and then your file name. Hit control enter. And as you can see, just the file is run, but it is not loaded. So this is how you can write to file, load files, and just run Python files in Jupyter Notebook. If you have any questions, let me know in the comments below.